months after the pandemic stay-at-home orders began, there is one thing that still fully hasn't returned, and that is the infamous Boston traffic. WBZ's Lisa Hughes is back with that story tonight. Lisa? Yeah, David, if you have to drive, this may be one of the few aspects of the pandemic that's an improvement. MassDOT officials say statewide there are about 20% fewer cars on the road from this time last year. Now, obviously, traffic varies greatly depending on where you are. As you get closer to Boston, it's down in places as much as 25%, and in the city, it's been cut practically in half. But that doesn't mean there isn't still congestion on some of the busiest roads. Even though our volumes have, have crept back up, the, there is no notable peak travel times in the morning and afternoon. There's not, not a huge rush hour, so to speak, like there used to be. We see a bump, but it's nowhere near as pronounced as it was. There is also a big change coming. Federal rules require that we change our exit numbers to reflect a system that's based on mileage. That project is expected to begin next month with Route 140 between Bedford and Taunton and end next summer. That should be New Bedford. To check out the new numbers, you can go to our website because it can be confusing. That's CBSBoston.com. Paula, David? That's right, a lot of new signs. <laughs> yes. A lot of people a lot have there.